Hey there, Elle. Um, thanks for watching my video or taking the time to watch my video. I know you have a lot to go through, so I'm going to try and make this as fast as I can because I know you have a lot to go through, like I said. And, um, yeah, I know you don't want to sit watching videos all day, even though, you know, it is fun. <laughs> anyway, um, this is my look for a dazzling summer night theme. Um, I had a lot of fun doing this look, and I hope you like it. Um, yeah. And I'll see you in just a sec. Bye. Alright, let's get started. First, I already what I already did was apply my um, Revlon Beyond Natural Primer to my eyes. And I've also um, applied the Love Revlon Beyond Natural Sorry, text message. <laughs> um, Revlon Beyond Natural Skin Matching Makeup. I've already done that part, so we'll make this short because, Elle, I know you have a lot of videos to get through. First, what we're going to do is we're going to take our Jasmine LaBelle Cosmetics um, little um, pot in this hot pink color. <laughs> and I'm going to take my Revlon All Over Color Brush. And I'm going to put it right on my lid. I apologize if it looks like I'm squinting right now because I have glasses and I'm like blind without them. So I'm going to try and do this the best I can without them. So I need to grab my mirror. Anyway, get some. I also apologize because I have allergies right now. Get some on your your brush just like this. And we're going to apply this just just to our lid. Next, what you're going to do is we're going to take um, our flat brush. I got this. I don't know. It's kind of generic. It's just this flat little brush. And we're going to take our Ultimate Wet n Wild Ultimate Expressions Palette in Paradise Cove. And I'm going to be using this purple color right here. Right there at the bottom. And that's going to be applied to the crease. I'm going to kind of get a lot on there because... Um, my my look is inspired by sunset and there's lots of colors in the sunset so put it right in your crease we're going to be using this brush again for another color in just a minute so you just set that right aside and we're going to take for the MAC 227 brush um, and I'm going to be taking another Jasmine LaBelle Cosmetics um, Trio this one is doesn't have a name, but um, we're going to be using this little pink color right here. And that's going to be our highlight. We're going to use this as our, cre or our as our highlight for now. Um, so just apply it right up to the brow bone. We're going to be using another color over it in just a moment. This just kind of acts like a base. Alright, next what you're going to do so you're going to take that flat brush again. It doesn't have a name. I'm sure you can find it you know, any store, really. Um, and we're going to take... I'm going to be taking this old one that I've got. It's a Mary Kay Eye Glam Shadow Duo. And this, this color right here, this darker color, kind of reminds me of the night sky. And it's got kind of like little shimmery specks in it. I don't know if you can see that or not. Probably not. But, um... We're going to be using that, so swirl it around in your brush, we're going to be using it in the inner corner of our eye and the outer corner, but not in the middle. So you just apply it to the inner and the outer corner as well. Alright, now you're going to take your Revlon All Over Color Brush, if I can find it, again, and I'm going to be going back to that hot pink pot that I've got and just put a little bit on your brush. You don't want a lot on it this time because we're going to be using that over the highlight color. So just, you want to sweep it on but not a lot because it will make it very apparent because it's pretty um, pigmented. So sweep it on right over that light pink color. 
might need a little bit more to match my other eye. But you can put on as much as you would like. You're going to take your CoverGirl Perfect Point Plus eye, um, eyeliner and we're going to line our top lash line and our water line as well. Sorry, I keep my eye up. We're going to take our Lash Blast Mascara, CoverGirl Mascara. This stuff is my favorite. If you watch my videos, you definitely will know that. I use it in everything. And you're just going to apply it to your top and bottom lashes. <laughs> Alright, now we're done with the eyes. Next what you're going to do is I'm going to use this dense kabuki brush. And I'm going to get my Wet n Wild bronzer in Tahitian Tan. This is a very good color. I love this one. Uh oh. I thought I had gotten mascara on my eye, but I didn't. I'm just going to dab it in because this brush is very dense, as you can see, and it's picking up a lot of the product. So just tap it in. Tap off any excess that you see. And I kind of make a fish face when I do this because I can see the apples of my cheeks better. So you just kind of make it a fish face, and right along that line that contours your face, apply the bronzer. Just like so, it gives you that little beach glow, like you've been out on the beach all day. Alright, th now that you're done with that, you're just, when it's summer, you're not going to apply a big lip gloss, so we're going to apply um, just a light pink gloss and we're just going to apply that to our lips and your look is done I hope you enjoyed this owl I had a really fun make time making it and um, yeah um, congratulations on your 60,000 subscribers again that's amazing <laughs> I'll see you guys later bye